how we're doing folks uh, so back with another iPhone 7 Plus video this time we're looking at the ESR um, full cover tempered glass screen protector um, apparently according to them this is a full protection with aesthetic appeal Ooh. okay so the, uh, the purpose of, the, of, the, uh, of these couple of videos that I've got I've got a couple of tempered glass screen protector videos coming out is to show you what they look like on the phone and to also taste a bit taste not taste, we don't want to be tasting tempered glass screen protectors, test their compatibility with a couple of cases that we've got with us. Um, so this is again, this is the ESR um, something. I found it on Amazon, as, well, as I have done with quite a lot of mo most of these tempered glass screen protectors. Um, there will be a link to it, uh, the Amazon link underneath um, in the description. It's pa apparently past something. So that's been a marketing ploy. Let's have a quick look. Installation auxiliary tools. Keep stunned with ESR case for information on first hand product news and fabulous events. Wow, okay. Lovely. Very interesting. Um, let's have a look. So ooh, we've got oh we've got a fantastic little applicator for the iPhone. I love it when screen tents come with this because it should technically make the screen tent play application. Flawless. This one is a full body tempered glass screen protector, so it's got the um, white around it, so it should fit literally on the face of the phone like that. And we'll see how it goes. So let's give it a go, shall we? So you can see that the, the screen protector is now on. It's the white is a reasonably good white for the phone. It, I've got a bit of a an air bubble here. This could be completely my fault. It could be the fact that the screen protector is not very good. I don't know yet. Um, so let's turn the phone on. The phone is now turned on. You can see that the screen protector isn't affecting really the, the clarity of the phone. It's still very nice and clear. I even meddled with my brightness or anything and um, this is exactly how I normally have the phone um, obviously because it's a full body screen protector it does come up around the, the fingerprint sensor so the fingerprint sensor is a little bit indented now doesn't affect usability you can still get in there so you clicks and your fingerprint there you go. it's not affecting any sort of usability we can see there actually there's a, there's a little YouTube comment from somebody hello Saranash Garg it's Garge Garge I have no idea it's not affecting any usability of the phone, which is pretty nice. We can see here, look, oh, got those cases that we're going to quickly try out now. So, the screen protector overall looks reasonably decent. Um, let's try it with a couple of cases. Um, and we'll just go sort of logically through the pile that I've got here. Um, first of all, we've got the Spigen. Um, slim case, air skin case, that's what it's called. And um, these air skin and the flexi slim case, I can't imagine should have much issue with any with any screen protector really because they don't really apply. And this is what they're built for really is to have this case on with like a screen protector like this because actually now the case, the phone is re fairly reasonably well protected. You protect on the front with the screen protector, you protect on the back with the air skin or the flexi slim case. So that works perfectly. Look at that. That's pretty goddamn perfect. Perfect sort of case for this sort of screen protector, really, if you want the um, the lighter approach. Approach. Getting the, the case off is another man now, because you've got nothing to grip onto when trying to get the case off. So, Spigen air, cush, air, air skin case, yeah, baby. Uh, you've got the, the Orsley Flexi Slim case, a very similar type of case. Um, a little bit more grippy, a bit more flexible. And again, pretty nice. Of course, it comes in different colours. Yeah, again, works perfectly fine. There's no lipping. Um, it's not affecting the screen protector in any way. Uh, a really, an, a, another really good um, combination of case and screen protector. A bit easier to get off that one because it's a bit more fluid. 
Uh, stick with, let's go with Spigen again. We've got the iPhone 7 Plus Ultra Hybrid case. This one's a bit thicker than the, the air cushion. Gives it a little bit more protection. Also lips a little bit onto the screen. So let's see how this deals with the screen protector being on the phone. Making sure we get it on. So you've still got a reasonable lip on the screen with the case. Again, not affecting any usability of the phone. And it's not coming up, it's not peeling any of the corners. So yeah. Beautiful. Works well. I like it. I like it a lot. So um, that was the air cushion ultra hybrid case. That's a win. Uh, we've got the Rink Crystal View case, which is this one here. Very similar sort of case to the um, uh, what, was, what was that one? What's called? Just the uh, not the air cushion one. The, the ultra hybrid. Uh, I don't know how I forgot on that. I've, I've, I've reviewed that case so many different times in different so many different phones. Um, Again, yeah, that works perfectly fine. Beautiful. No lipping in the corners, gives it a good ridge. It's not affecting the screen. Lovely, yeah. Again, another win. Fun. Bloody tastic. So next we've got the Orsley Fusion bumper case. So very similar case to the Crystal Crystal View and the Ultra Hybrid from Spigen. This one is again a hardback with the rubberized outsides. But this time it's got a bit of a um, rubber inside and so with different colours that you can select. Gives it a bit more impact protection. Again, so there we go. That's that, that case on there. Looks pretty decent. Nice with the colours. Works. Probably gives you a bit bigger lip on the screen than, the, than those other two cases, so a little bit more protection alongside the extra impact protection of for the screen. Um, and it's not lifting the corners at all, you can't see any lifting, and it works, it's not affecting the screen in any way, which is fantastic. Yeah, beautiful. On to the next case, I hear you say. Next, so we've actually just got a bunch of Orsley cases left now. Um, nothing. No other companies have gone through the speaking ones. Got quite a lot of speaking ones in iPhone 7, but not 7 Plus, which is a bit of a boy. So this is the um, Duo Armor from Orsley. It's a complete, complete two-piece case, TPU and hardback, with rhinestones in different colours. So no lifting yet. I think the benefit of, the, of this this screen protector has for cases is because because when you apply it with this, obviously it's not quite going to the full edge. So it should work, I think, with most cases. Just make sure apply the full armor of the phone. So this is the Duo Armor case. Um, comes in lots of different colours and ooh, shah, sparkly rhinestones, yay! Um, yeah, a nice big lip on the screen. It's not pulling the screen protector up in any sort of place. Very good. I like it. I always have trouble getting this case off then. It's a very difficult case to get off. Which, again, I say every time. I, every time I say it's difficult to case to get off, it's a good thing for your phone because if you drop your phone, the case, the case isn't just going to pile off itself and. Then on the second impact, your phone dies. It's going to stay on. It's very difficult to case to get off there. So, Duo Armor is a go with the ESR screen protector. Good to know. Uh, next, we've got the Orsley Grip Pro. This is personally one of my favourite cases. It's a little bit thinner than the Duo Armor, but it's a two-piece case. It's got the TPU, the really nice, oh, really nice feeling TPU case. 
that slips around your phone to protect it. And then we've got the Orsley case, the bit that goes around the back of it. So, actually, here we go. So this is the first case that we can see that isn't working with this screen protector. You can see in the corners, it's lifting quite heavily. So we're not going to go any further. Let's just try and rub it back in. No, that's, that's properly lifting at those two corners there. That's an issue. So if you've got an Orsley Grip Pro or you like this case, this screen protector potentially not be the, the right thing for you. Um, keep an eye out for all the other TX September Glass screen protectors. Hopefully there's one that works with this case. Well, we know there is already because we, we have trialed the Orsley um, non full screen screen protector, and that does work. So you can see as soon as the case has come off, it's a de a de a de That's not really a word. Adhesived? No, it's not a word either. It's it's stuck back to the screen. <laughs> so that's a no for the Orsley Grip Pro. And then we've just got the um, flexi case. So a nice clear TPU case, a little bit thicker than the Flexi Slim and the Spigen Air one, but not as thick as the Fusion ones. Let's have a look. So, yeah. Not impacting the screen texture at any of the corners, that's a bonus, that's a good win. Um, doesn't obviously provide as much protection, doesn't really give you much of a rim around the side, but yeah. It's a nice looking case and it works with the screen protector. So that's a go. That's the flexi case. And then we've got the lovely flip case. And if you've seen any of my videos before, you know my thoughts on flip cases. And lots of people love them. I am just not one of those people. I can't see why this would this case wouldn't work with the screen protector. And you know, doesn't doesn't prove me wrong. It works perfectly fine. Nice case, it feels pretty nice, um, and the screen protector's on, and it works perfectly fine with it. So that's a wrap on the cases with the screen protectors. This, this, just to confirm for you, it was the ESR FZ Temper Glass Screen Protector. Um, it's a full cover Temper Glass Screen Protector, full protection with aesthetic appeal. Fantastic! It's triple strength according to their promotion material there. Whatever that means. So to confirm, flip case, yes. Dual armor case, yes. Flexi case, yes. Fusion bumper case, yes. Uh, da, 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 da. Spigen ultra hybrid case, yes. Flexi slim, yes. Fusion, uh, Spigen air case, um, air skin case, yes. And the Rink crystal clear case, bang on. Although, I've got to be honest, telling the difference between the uh, Rink crystal cl crystal case and the Spigen ultra hybrid case, they're pretty much the same case. <laughs> Good job, manufacturers. Good job, guys. They're literally the same case. <laughs> I love it. Anyway, I've been Johnny. This has been the ESR FZ full covered body tempered screen protector thing. See you next time. Um, please like the video, share it, comment if you've got any questions, and uh, I'll get back to you. See you next time. Goodbye.